Hey guys, <clears throat> one of the things that uh, you've probably heard a lot is, uh, well, hey, this head needs to be milled or it needs to be resurfaced. Um, so there's a couple ways we can go about doing that. I want to uh, show you those uh, here today. There's a couple of different processes where we will actually go in and resurface the cylinder head and the block. Uh, we have this machine here, which is a uh, it's a rotary broach. You can see there's a cylinder head set up on it. And we will set up the cylinder head on it. And the table traverses underneath the head. These two clamps here will actually grab the head. And there's actually a, a rotary cutting head underneath that rotates. And this table traverses. And it will actually resurface the head. That's uh, one way that we do this. We also have an overhead machine, which is an overhead mill. Uh, this one here. The way this works is it has a traversing head. This, uh, this entire head up here traverses back and forth across the cylinder head. It's got a, a rotary broach cutter similar to that. And what we do is we have to make sure that the head is perfectly square. So we take a dial indicator and we set it up actually on the head itself. And then we'll run this dial indicator all the way across the length of the head and make adjustments as necessary. Once we get the head absolutely straight, which we have done here, we will go ahead and set the machine uh, to run. And you can see that we've got a head here that just came off of there. And this head's been freshly milled. That's The mate to it is on the machine now. And so, <clears throat> very simply, we just turn on the machine we're going to loosen this up and we have an indicator here. We have an up and down indicator and we actually have thousandths of an inch here. So we just want to take a small bite. We're probably going to take uh, maybe three thousandths of an inch. So we just go down about three thousandths, lock our spindle into place, and then bring our cutting head up, set the feed down here, and she's ready to rock and roll. This is not a real fast machine, but it's also not something that you have to stand here and watch. <laughs> so once you get it set, once you get everything leveled, you can actually walk away and go work on something else. You don't have to you know, stand here and babysit the machine. So uh, we also set up cylinder blocks on this same machine. So we have another setup with a different type of fixture. So we can actually mill the surface of the head of the block. And if you have warpage, that's what you have to do. Uh, simply because your head gasket surface will not seal. So there you have it. Uh, I know it's hard to get this out of a book or it's hard to have somebody explain this to you without seeing it, so I wanted you to see this.